news on Friday, top Iranian nuclear scientist Mohsin Fakhrizadeh was assassinated in Iran. Mohsin Fakhrizadeh was the founder of Iran's nuclear program and he was the main force behind Iran's missile program as well. Uh, since Friday, Iran has been saying that it will retaliate. Now, a speculation is going on that what will be the mode of retaliation uh, to be adopted by Iran? Uh, in what way will Iran retaliate for the killing of uh, Mohsin Fakhrizadeh? Well, viewers, uh, I see four likely scenarios and Iran might uh, adopt one of these four ways uh, for retaliation of the killing of Mohsin Fakhrizadeh. Uh, firstly, was Iran is accusing Israel. Iran has openly accused Israel of having carried out the assassination of Mohsin Fakhrizadeh. But some Iranian officials, they are naming Saudi Arabia and UAE as well. They are saying that Saudi Arabia and UAE, they are also part of the pl plot of assassination of Mohsin Fakhrizadeh. Uh, now, there's four likely scenarios. Firstly, I think, Iran could mobilize its proxies in the region. Uh, Iran backed uh, Houthis in Yemen. Uh, Iran backed uh, Hezbollah in Lebanon. Iran supported uh, Hamas. Uh, Iran might activate one of these uh, proxies against Israel or Saudi Arabia as a retaliation for the killing of uh, Mohsin Fakhrizadeh. First scenario. Second scenario is direct retaliation, we were just like we saw in the case of Qasem Soleimani. When Qasem Soleimani was killed in a drone strike in January this year by the US, uh, Iran carried out missile strikes on an American military base in Iraq. Uh, so Iran might go for direct retaliation as well, though uh, it does not seem very possible, I think. And thirdly, viewers, Iran could step up its nuclear enrichment activities. Yesterday, Iranian parliament called upon uh, Iranian government uh, to stop uh, the access which Iran gave to IAEA inspectors to carry out surprise checkings of Iranian nuclear facilities. And uh, Iranian parliament called upon the government of Iran to enrich uranium up to 20%. Iran is allowed to enrich uranium up to 3.6% uh, viewers. If Iran goes beyond that, it means that it is violating uh, the agreement it signed in 2015 JCPOA deal. Uh, so in the coming days, Iran might announce uh, nuclear enrichment over 3.6%. Uh, it will also be retaliation for the killing of Mohsin Fakhrizadeh. And lastly, words, Iran just uh, might remain silent and we might see just uh, Iran issuing statements and doing nothing.